stand on their way here in race one on the program and Diane Fist was a fraction slow to begin in fact he go, goes back to last early there with Lynn's master and Apollo Rock at the top end there with Senior You Think who's pushing up on the insider but Apollo Rock had the speed to lead from Soon You Think, Cloud Shadow and Commodore Lincoln is moving up three horses wide. He'll be outside the leader soon. Now All White is placed midfield on the outside of Good Deal. So he is within striking distance there, the race favourite. They were followed by Sun Force and Jal. Then JJ Star Limbs Master and Iron Fist is last of all as they go onto the long course and Apollo Rock. Now sets up the lead by three parts of a length over Commodore Lincoln. And in third placing, soon you think with the drop on the leaders, Cloud Shadow is taking closer order on the outside from Good Deal. And then came All White Jal. Sun Force back towards the tail end of the field there with Iron Fist. And they were followed by Limbs Master. And now last is JJ Star as they race inside the uh, 700 metres mark. And Apollo Rock, he extends the lead now. He really starts to jazz up the tempo there under... Winston Chia, Apollo Rock he's out by four and a half, Commodore Lincoln I don't think he had any more to offer and they were followed by Soon You Think he's about to knuckle down, Good Deal is running a much better race as well from Limbs Master, Cloud Shadow and All White has about seven lengths to make up they've got to, uh, this one Apollo Rock as Soon You Think goes up to it quickly and Commodore Lincoln, well he looked gone on the home turn, he's coming back and Limbs Master at big odds is running a cheeky race but now Commodore Lincoln takes the lead from Limbs Master and also Soon you think it's going to be Commodore Lincoln. And Commodore Lincoln goes on to win by two and a half limbs master. Soon you think ran third. And Apollo Rock ran fourth from Good Deal. All White was well back all in the event there with JJ Star, Cloud Shadow, Jal. Iron Fist was never a factor. Sun Force at the back. So Commodore Lincoln takes out the first on the program. Number seven, Essia came from the outside barrier and he'll pay around 124 for the win, 27 the place. It looked as though he was struggling on the home turn. He was outside the leader. He dropped about six or seven lengths behind the front runner, Apollo Rock. But Apollo Rock was found wanting halfway down the straight and Commodore Lincoln kept on batting away nearer the rail. In a grinding go to the line, and Commodore Lincoln gets up at the uh, big odds this afternoon. So SC takes the ride for AB Abdullah. And Commodore Lincoln, his last win was back in uh, April of last year when he was successful over the mile. So the numbers will be coming through very soon, but Commodore Lincoln takes out the first, and Limbs Master will add a bit of spice to the trifectas there, Limbs Master. He was about 280 plus for the win. So it's going to be huge dividends there for the exotics. And we'll stand by for the numbers to be confirmed. Here they come 7, 11, 4. 7, 11, 7, 11, 4, and 2. Your numbers here after race 1 7, 11, 4, and 2. Commodore Lincoln, the 11 year old. He's a brown gelding by Ifraj out of Zazanali. He's a New Zealand bred performer. Trained by A.B. Abdullah, ridden by Asir. The runner-up is the 11, that is Lim's master, Johnny Lim, the trainer. And ridden by Emek Diha. And third is number four, Soon You Think. Trained by Kevin Coatesy, ridden by H.S. Skill. Number two, Apollo Rock, back in fourth placing, ridden by Winston Chia. Margins are three and a quarter, a length and a quarter, with a further length and a quarter to fourth in 144.9. 144.9, the time after the first of the day, those numbers confirmed. 7, 11, 4 and 2. So an upset result there to start off the 12 race program here in Kale this afternoon with Commodore Lincoln getting up at huge odds and uh, doing a very good job from the outside barrier. 144.9, the time after race 1.